This video will walk you through the event process using DNR's Access Flow support tool. If you have an approved appropriation, you will have received an email indicating an Access Flow event has begun. From this email, you'll see the event justification, which may help you decide if you would like to enter a request. To do so, log into the DSS. At the top, navigate to events. If your appropriator organization has an approved appropriation, it will be displayed here. The appropriation number is linked to the approved water right. By clicking this link, you will be able to see the information that your appropriator organization provided to DNR that was approved for this appropriation. To make a request, click anywhere on the diversion of interest. Here I see I have no requests and allocations, but by pressing request, I can enter a request for DNR to review. In the top left, I select the request date. Next to each facility for my project, I can see what was entered in the appropriation. I can choose which facilities I want to use and enter the amount of water. Total and should be less than the full appropriation amount. Finally, I'll enter comments for DNR to understand my use case. For instance, if I need to season, perhaps I'll enter a higher value for the first day and then reduce it after. At this point, click request in the lower right and DNR will be notified of your request. When DNR has allocated water, you and your appropriator contacts will receive a notification by email. In events, Click your appropriation diversion of interest. You will see the appropriation amount listed both in the top line as well as the current request. Click view and you will see the details, including which facilities DNR has indicated should be used, as well as any comments and a link to the notice. This notice will also be sent directly by DNR staff. If for some reason during the access flow event, you need to change your request, you can always go back in and enter a new request for DNR. When DNR decides to end an access flow allocation, you will receive a notification. In the DSS, go to events, and you will now see your allocation amount is zero. Once the event ends, you'll always be able to access previous allocations under the history 